Um, welcome to see Sparkles Corner. Today is October 27, 2023, and today we're going to have some fun. We're going to play Two Point Hospital together. Now, I've deleted all my saves, and so save slots. Let's delete them. Okay. All right, so that way we're going to start a new game together, and I have gone into the settings because I'm going under audio because of, you know, YouTube. I've turned off the music, the DJ volume, and the music list. Okay. I want to leave this sound effects on, and I'm going to turn off the master volume. Okay. I don't want to get in any trouble from YouTube for copyright. Even if it's two seconds or a minute, they will get you for it. Okay. So we're going to start a new game. We also have two-point campus enroll. But we're going to play Two Point Hospital, the main game. We'll do that one way later, so let's play. At the beginning, they're going to teach us how to do it. Over 52% of our patients believe they live healthier. Our precise calibration equipment is operated by Compassion Healthcare, many of whom have been to medical school and medically trained. Let us ease our worry, noggin, and gently fix your body. Hmm. Jeff's infection is no laughing matter. Put your trust in overseas shoes. We're building a brighter future, safer for hardly anything we will stand in our way. You deserve the best. So join us at Two Point Hospital. We're open for new staff, patients, and a new you. Can I go play golf? Yes. Okay. So we're going to start. The first few levels is going to be just for training as we go. And these are bugs. We got to get that. Okay. Welcome to Two Point Hospital. This is Hog Sport. And here's your first hospital. Click on it to get started. Okay, private. Let's see what it says. The Superbug Initiative is happy to announce that the A Project Ice and Fire Global Project has been completed with the invention of two glorious fountains. Minor thermal discount should finally become a thing of the past. Well done, everyone. Thank you for your continued cooperation. Sophie Novi, CEO of Bundle Technology. All right, let's be view the product. Superbug. Hair removal. Okay. All right, we're going to continue. Hogsport, there's three stars, okay? And later on, there'll be a four star. And we'll go over that in a little bit when it comes. But we need to do the first three stars. And so we have... Foundation value, 200000 Share price, $0.20 cent per share. We have no stars, no Kurdish by completing challenges, and no Remax. Okay, so we're going to start. The game as we go, this is the first level is like going to be teaching. Two Point Hospital, welcome to Two Point Country. Are you ready to start building your first hospital? And cure some patients? Okay. Look around the hospital. First thing you'll probably want to do is look around. To move your mouse in the hospital, hold the right mouse button and drag the cursor using the W, A, S, and D keys. Okay. So we're going to go W, S, D, A, and D. Okay. And the Q turns it. Okay. So the first thing 
we're going to go down here. This is where we hire. This is our items. This is our rooms. This is the characters, staff, patient illness. This is our money for prices, which we will be adjusting as needed. And this is visual mods. Okay. So we're going to close all these. And we're going to open the items. And we're going to do what the tutor wants us to do and put up our first receptions. Now, holding your left key and moving your right hand gets to move it. So we're going to build the reception desk. Done. Da -da 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 -da. Now we need to hire a receptionist. Those are going to be under assistance. We have different ones we will start with. And we will start with Lynn Litch and put her up there. Okay, done. General practitioner's office is in the room building. Okay, so we want to turn over here. And we want to go over to here, over to here. And we're going to open our rooms. We're going to go to our GP office. And we want to build him. All right, now we're going to put up a door. And we want to have the office, the practitioner, face away with that. And we're going to put up a bookcase. And we want the practitioner to sit here. Okay? So we want to put a bin in his office. And we want to put a fire extinguisher in his office. And let's get some prestige here. We're going to get the sonic rug. In here. And now... Sonic poster. We want people I, to be happy. Miami, okay, cars. now we're done that. Okay. Now we're going to hire a doctor. A doctor. Diagnosis. And diagnosis. All right, we want to get him. And we want to put up some seats. And we want to put up a leaflet. Okay. We've got to diagnose a patient. We want to build a second GP's office. There's a way you can do that. Okay. You can go like this. See where the lines are? Right click. It's highlighted. It won't let you do it yet. Okay. That'll be for later. Pharmacy required. Get patient to wait. So we're going to put a pharmacy right up here. Okay, there's that. 
Let's get the seconds up. Extinguisher up. And a bin is up. Okay. Now we've got to hire a nurse. And they're under nurses. And I'm sick I'm going to hire this one. Now we need to hire a janitor. Okay. We don't have a janitor. Items. Let's get the sonic rug down. All right. We need to get to put up a drink machine. Patient cures. Okay. We're going to put up a drink machine and a snack machine. And we're going to put up a trash can. All right. All right. Keeping people happy. Item controls. Yeah. Our, Our representative. Okay. Okay, let's see what else is available. Uh, okay, we've got to build a staff room. Okay, let's go in there and see. Here is the staff room. Okay, we're going to turn around like this. Oops. Okay. We're going to go over our W and A hitting that. We're going to. All right. We've got our, we're building our staff room. Okay. Armchair. Okay. Our employees are going to need lockers to put their stuff in. Let's put down some sonic rugs to improve the decorativeness of our staff room. Okay. There's nothing available. Okay, we can open a big bin. All right, we're going to put up a trash can there. That's all we can open up. Okay, there's our staff room. Done. Staff room, staff will head to the Staff room when they need a break, they'll do it all on their own. A new illness has been found. Selfie talking chumps. We'll send them to our pharmacy. Okay. Drinks and snacks are great for keeping people happy, but they can lead to littering if there's no bins nearby. So, well, we already put down a bin. We already knew about that. Toilets are unlocked. Okay. All right. I'm deciding where I'm going to put my toilet. I think I'll put it right next here. Let's see if we can. All 
All right, we're going to go to this end. Because I want to keep that spot next to him. Because eventually the game will want to GP's offices. Okay. Okay, we're going to put down our toilet. Right, let's put down our toilet. The maintenance man will keep. The toilet together. Sink. A hand dryer. A big bin. A big bin. Okay. Let's put up a couple of Sonic posters. We want people to feel comfortable in the restroom. Okay. There, we've done it. We have two. Okay, we're hearing reports of some new illness in town. This might be harder to diagnose it, so we need to build a new diagnosis room if GP certainly isn't certain they will send the patient there for further diagnosis. Okay. All right, we're going to go back under rooms and look up the general diagnosis. As you expand the hospital with more rooms and staff, the hospital level increases. The larger the hospital attracts more patients. As you build, the hospital gets busier. Queues may start to get long lines. We need to build more GP offices in other rooms and hire more to deal with extra patients. Look out for the queue warnings above the rooms. You can hover over them to see how many people are queuing. Okay, I want to build a second GP office. I messed that up. All right, let's go. I want a second GP office before I get the new diagnosis. Turning this around. All right. Big bin. All right. Sonic rug. Okay, Jasmine. All right. Now let's, we're going to hire another doctor. All right, let's put a comfortable bench down. All right. Okay, now let's put down a carpet. I want our Sims to be happy little go-getters. All right, now we're gonna go back to the room. Let's see if we can get, nope, 
too small of an arrow. Okay, we're going to turn this around. Okay, we're going to start going to the room. General diagnosis. You've got to live room for the people to walk down to the toilet. Okay. General diagnosis. Let's get a filing cabinet. Let's put Big Ben in there. Weighing scale is open. I don't care about that. I just... Let's see what else is open. Drawings. Ivy, spider, and purple. Okay. All right. All right, we need to hire a nurse. Okay. Let's see how this is. Okay, let's call the maintenance man. Okay, that's all right. All right, now we're going to open a ward. Okay, we need a ward. Okay, now we're going to get All right, let's put up some beds. Okay, let's put up a locker so patients can keep their clothes in it. Well, we know it's not really real, but we want to make the room look as nice as possible, okay? There is that. Let's put up a clock so that way they can know the time of day. All right. Now we need to hire another nurse. Okay. That has a ward symbol on it. Let's get her in here. Hospital star rating. The Two Point Health Ministry to Keen recognized achievements of every hospital in the country. If we can build a hospital that satisfies the needs of the local area, the hospital will be awarded an official star rating. This will be for our organizations. Not only does each star come with associated war rewards, but it will also allow us to establish new hospitals around the country. Continue to expand to acquire the one-star rating. Okay, staff promotion. Okay, we need to do that. Kudos. By completing objectives and challenges, our organization earns kudos. We can use this to gain new items. Take a look at the items list, and the items with the padlock can be unlocked by using K. Best of all, we can purchase items of any of our hospitals use it wisely new illness is bog wash discovered our doctor have discovered a new illness bog wash a rather disgusting condition used by filthy toilets it can be cured 
with an expensive cocktail of drugs carefully prepared in the pharmacy or with witchcraft. We'll send patients there for treatment in our pharmacy. Okay, Misery Guts Pharmacy. Here are three patients with lightheadedness. Okay, let's go to the room. Deluxe. All right, now we're going to have lightheadedness. That's a bit bigger of a room. Okay, let's go over here and build our lightheadedness. Gonna put it in the corner, and we're gonna have our nurse or doctor face there. Okay, fire extinguisher, Big Ben. Okay, let's put up our clock. Voila. Now we gotta hire a doctor for lightheadedness. All right, we need to put up a bench. And now let's put down a rug. All right, let's see what's open. Nice, okay. A holy wreath. Okay. We're gonna get a one-star hospital. Let's see what this is, okay. We need to fill our snack machines. We're checking our toilet. It's okay. Checking the easy scan. There you go. Only certain items can be rebuilt. All right. We have plenty of things for our maintenance crew to do. Did you know in building a room you can pick up a by clicking on the floor of the room and you can move them, rotate them and replace them like an item. Yes, we can do that. But we've got pretty good thing right here. One stop, one star. We're heading it. Once we get one more thing of light headedness, we will have our first star. Then we will can we will save after that and shut off because that'll be our first upload for this hospital and we will play it more after what i'm trying to do at this point is to get one save of each of the games i have up there and so we're doing that for fun and i appreciate you playing this with me this is such a fun game and it has a lot of challenges as we go and it gets much more challenging as we go You will see it as we go. Yep. We have too many Dr. Seville or idle. Hmm. When the patients get more busy, they won't be idle. We have cured two patients of lightheadedness. 
We will cure one more. Yep. And see, you can pick up. Okay. You also can pick up a doctor like this. And move him in here. And move her in there, see? They can take breaks. Yeah, that one didn't survive. Let's see what the grand janitors do. Well, we gotta have him pick up a ghost. And see the jan only the janitors with the ghost symbol can pick up a ghost. We've got a janitor with ghost capturing capability. So we've got it covered. So we're okay. But you've got to keep an eye on it. These things can catch fire. And as you go, you'll have more of them to keep an eye on. Yep, so it'll go. We will click Cure. As the game goes on, we're going to be able to do research and all kinds of things. But right now, where this is just the first level and it's really basics, it's just teaching you the basics of what you need to do in that order. Did you know you can view your staff characteristics tab? Use the staff list to monitor, review, pay, and control their jobs. I apologize for yawning. I did not sleep at all last night. And so, but I'm good to be home. I spent two nights at my mother's, and <laughs> she did not sleep. So trust me, nobody else got to sleep. And she wasn't in the best of moods. But hey, that's the way it goes. We all get there. In the mood someday. So. Okay, let's view our yearly rewards. Probably don't get any, but hey, we'll try it. You can click open all. Oh, we got the Doctor of the Year Award. Nurse of the Year Award. Employer of the Year Award. Excellent. So we got three rewards. It's a good start. It's a good stop. Okay. We're not covering our expenses. Let's go to prices. Okay. We'll raise them to 80%. Hey, I'm a greedy hospital. Now we'll be covering our expenses. We should start gaining it. We got to get three more stars in this, but we've got two. You'll, you'll see as we go. I was hoping we could beat this level here without raising the prices, but it is what it is. And you go in here to characteristics staff. And to see how the mood is. On our staff, we go to the dollar sign. Okay, so we need to give them all a pay raise. Because we're in the yellow. Mm 
We want to get past there. Okay, there we go. Everybody got a pay raise now. So everybody is a happy camper. And we'll be able to upgrade stuff like this. We'll be able to be upgraded and stuff. Okay, here we go. A one-star hospital. Congratulations, your hospital has been awarded a one-star rating. That's one out of a possible three. By the Two Point Health Ministry, I have retrieved your file from my bin to celebrate. Continue to develop your enterprise and hog sport for further esteem and trickets. If you believe that you're capable of more alternative, run before you can walk and begin to expand your organization by opening the new lower, the new hospital at Lower Bullocks. The choice is yours. Yours, fragrantly. Health Minister Tarquin Foxbridge. Okay. Now, Lower Bollocks is open and Lighthouse Poster is open. And we, this is, uh, we will continue on this map. All right. And we are going to save. Quick save. Okay. We're going to quit. Thank you. Thank you for playing C Sparkle Corner with me. And when we get back into this, we will go on a two-star rating. Thank you for playing this with me. I really appreciate it. It's much more fun to play with somebody than by yourself. Thank you for joining me. And love you. I'll see you later. Bye, everybody.